how to make a checkerboard pattern on a 2x2, two 3x3, by 4x4, two, three by three, four by four, and 5x5. Five by five. Starting with the 2x2. Two two. Doing the 2x2 two two checkerboard pattern is super easy and simple. Just follow these steps. So, turn the right layer twice, like this. Then, turn the top layer twice, like this. Then, turn the front layer twice, like this. And lastly, turn the bottom layer twice, like this. And there you go, as you can see, you have the checkerboard pattern. You cannot actually do the full checkerboard pattern on a 2x2 or 4x4 or any even cube, so you will be left with two faces solved but you still have the checkerboard pattern on four faces. To reverse it, you just reverse what we just did. So to reverse it, turn the bottom layer twice, the front layer twice, the top layer twice, and the right layer twice. And there you go, that's how you do the two by two to checkerboard pattern. Now moving on to three by three. I actually think that the checkerboard pattern is easier on the 3x3 than the 2x2. So to do it, follow these steps. So first what you want to do is you want to turn the right layer twice, like that, and then turn the left layer twice. Next what you want to do is turn the front layer twice, and turn the back layer twice, like that. And lastly what you want to do is turn the top layer twice, and turn the bottom layer twice. And there you go, as you can see, we have the full checkerboard pattern on our 3x3. To reverse it, you just have to do it again. So, remember, do the right layer twice, left layer twice, front layer twice, back layer twice, top layer twice, and bottom layer twice. And there you go. Now, we have 4x4. Four 4x4 four. Four Four by four checkerboard pattern is a little more complicated, so make sure to follow these steps very carefully. So first, what we have to do is we have to turn the right layer twice, and we're basically just doing the three right three steps right now. Then turn the left layer twice, like three right three. Next, turn the front layer twice. Then turn the back layer twice. Lastly, turn the top layer twice and the bottom layer twice. So now we'll be left with this little pattern, which is not the checkerboard pattern. So what we actually have to do to get the checkerboard pattern is a few more moves. So first what we have to do is we want to turn these two layers together. So the two right layers together and turn them twice. One, two, like that. Then turn the two top layers together like this. One, two, and make sure to do it twice. Next what you wanna do is turn the two front layers together twice like that and lastly what you want to do is turn the two top layers twice again like this and now you'll see that we do have a checkerboard pattern on four of the sides and unfortunately it does not work on two of the sides and it just gives you this pattern but uh this is the closest way that you can do it next we have five by five 5x5 five five checkerboard pattern is fairly easy, and this time you can do it on all the sides because 5x5 five five is an odd number cube. The only ways that you can't do it on all six sides is if it's an even number cube. So like 2x2, two 4x4, four 6x6, four, six six, 8x8, and so on. So to do the 5x4 checkerboard pattern, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to turn the right layer twice, like that. And then what we're going to want to do is we want to turn the first two right layers twice, like that. Then we're going to turn the first three right layers twice, like that. And finally turn the right four layers twice, like that. And basically, we're going to do that with the top layer now. So first top layer, turn it twice. First and second, turn it twice. First, second, and third, turn it twice. First, second, third, and fourth, turn it twice. And as you can see, there we go. And lastly, what we have to do is we have to do the front layer. So turn the front layer twice. Turn the two front layer twice, three twice, and lastly four twice. And as you can see, we now have the checkerboard pattern. To reverse it, 
uh, you can just do the same thing. Right layer twice, two right layer twice, three right layer twice, four right layer twice, one top layer twice, two top layer twice, three top layer twice, four top layer twice, one front layer twice, two front layer twice, three front layer twice, four front layer twice, and I messed that up there, but there. As you can see, we now have the whole cube. And that's it for this video, guys. This is how to do a checkerboard pattern for 2x2, 3x3, 4x4, and 5x5. If you learned how to do a checkerboard pattern in this video, make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll keep making more of this type of content. Uh, thank you so much, guys, for watching to the end, and I'll see you guys in the next one.